welcome to Grace Today, a daily vlog designed to encourage you and equip you with the Word of God. Let's begin. All right, friends, we are back with a Monday episode and back in looking at the book of Colossians. Just wanted to say thank you all very much for being uh, praying for us in our trip uh, for the funeral and just caring for us well as we prepared to go, as we got back, um, and as we caught up over the last couple of weeks. You are a great blessing to our family. We're very thankful for you. Uh, this week, we are returning to our look at Colossians and really thinking through how we apply the truths of Scripture that we're learning each Sunday. And this past Sunday, yesterday, we talked about how Christ is Lord of the church and how he is to have first place in everything. And then what a great time we'll have this week as we think on this. As we begin that, I want to point out to you something that I uh, pointed out briefly in the sermon that I think really deserves some of our attention and some of our meditation on in this hymn that runs from verses 15 through 20, so six verses, there are 13 personal pronouns referencing Christ in this short hymn. 13 times he is, there is a word in the verse pointing us, pointing our attention to Christ. What a glorious emphasis this hymn has on Christ. So let me encourage you today to read through the hymn, read through Colossians 1, 15 through 20, Think about how he is mentioned over and over again in the various ways he is mentioned and just spend some time praising the Lord for that glorious focus and asking the Lord that he would help you to have that focus in your life, that you would be so focused, that Christ would so infuse everything that you do, everything that you say, everything that you think about, that you would be like Paul. Just You just can't get away from Christ, from mentioning Christ, from thinking about Christ from talking about Christ, from serving Christ. What a glorious reminder that our focus should be like Paul's on the person of Christ. I pray this encourages you today as you think through Colossians 1.18. I love you, Grace Community, and I'm praying for you. Have a great day. Thanks for tuning in to Grace Today. For more information on Grace Community Baptist Church of Elgin, Texas, and how you can support this ministry, check out the links in the description below. See you tomorrow.